Hello everyone, we are back. So we got the Chinese stealth suit, lucky for us. And now we're supposed to contact some ex-military folk. So there's the flag. Alright. Wave. <sighs> Hope they see this. Small dweller, we see your signal. Make your way due north towards the hill. You'll see a concrete bunker. We will be watching your approach carefully. Alright. Interesting. Yep, definitely U.S. Army. Well, let's go see them. Hmm. Wasn't this a Free State bunker before? Well, here they are. Hello, Captain Fields. Oliver Fields, Captain, United States Army. Now that we've got the pleasantries out of the way, I have one question for you. Why the hell are you planning on stealing America's gold reserve? Uncle Sam not give you enough hugs and kisses while he was keeping you safe in that vault? Now hold on, we can explain, Captain. Alright, we want to use the gold for a new currency, create a real economy. Hey, in case you didn't notice, America's over. Kind of... Got bombed. Your U.S. Army? Where have you all been? We've been heading back down from up north. Before you ask why it took so long, take a long, hard look at your day-to-day -day in Appalachia. It's nice here. You've got it so good that I'd have wanted my mama to retire here. Giant bats. Boo-hoo. Okay, man. We want to use the goal for new currency. Create a real economy. World ends, suddenly every Tom, Dick, and Mary thinks they're in charge. What makes you so special, huh? I'm a firebreeder, the elite scorch hunter unit you know, for the responders. I don't know what the responders or the firebreathers are. But hunting those scorched seems vitally important and dangerous. Since we're both defenders of the people, in a manner of speaking, maybe you'll level with me. Do you know what your vault's primary mission was? Not the rebuilding America, Bull, the real mission. Um, our overseer was supposed to secure our Belichia's nuclear missile silos. That sounds in line with vault MO. I'm sure they didn't bother checking if that's okay with the Pentagon. All right, people, what do we think of this vault dweller? Radcliffe, Thompson, Lucky? I mean, I give anyone who doesn't shoot it as bonus points, so checks out to me. Yeah, holds up with everything we were able to recon. Page wasn't lying, at least. <laughs> Private All right, looks like you passed the test. Now let's talk about this Vault 79 you're so keen on breaking into. <laughs> There's a battery of high-end turrets we need to get past. Oh, we know all about them. Luckily, Paige gave us enough info to ID the problem. Sergeant Ratcliffe, you want to take it from here? We're dealing with Robco's semi-autonomous and mobile weapon platform, only used for special government procurement. Extra thick ballistic shielding, plus reflective paneling, and internal temperature regulation. Even has built-in air freshness. But can your new buddy Radcliffe beat him? Of course he can. Just need a little help from the source. Hmm. 
Anything you need, just tell me. Seeing as we have a good feeling about you, I say we work together on this one. You and I are going to meet up at the Robco Research Center down near Watoga. See if we can find the equipment I need to bust through those turrets. And we better hope we do, because my only backup plan is politely asking the turrets not to shoot us. And that never goes well. All right, Radcliffe, I'll see you there, and hopefully our, the plan works. It'll be fun. Forget the theme parks. There's nothing like scavenging a research center. Come Captain on, Fields. just make the best of it, people. Okay. This place is disgusting, Captain. Okay, I'll meet you there, I guess. Okay, we're here. Hey, you're not dead. I owe Thompson a cold one. Remember, we're looking for military research projects. General rule, they keep the good stuff in the back. Okay. So we're using our Chinese stealth suit because, well... Folks, I'll be honest with you, this is a... Build meant for killing Scorch, so... I don't exactly have the best of stuff here. What I can really do is just try. So here goes nothing. I'm not volunteering. Couldn't work my magic with those pincers anyway. They probably got some brains in storage somewhere. That seems like a very them thing to do. The entire research team jarred their brains? Whoa. I wonder how that went over. Good news for us though, right? <laughs> Just need to get one of them up and running. Ugh. You're saying all the employees are stuffed in a brain jar? Ugh. That's, uh. That's rather nasty. <laughs> Someone else here. Intruder, identify yourself. One of the brains is gone. Oh, that's never a good sign. Find a suitable brain, the facility wing. That's what we're in the facility wing. Uh, Gina's? Level G. Oh, poor Gina. Intelligence is required to learn more about this brain. Examine the brain thoroughly. If it's paused for a brain to radiate sadness, this one does. The folding of the cerebral cords is quite complex, however. Do I not have a high intelligence? Uh, I have 11 intelligence. Craig Brain. Intelligence was it required to learn more about this brain. Examine the brain thoroughly. This is a truly unremarkable brain in the best possible sense, assuming the extraction progress didn't traumatize him. Greg 
goes in should be a perfectly normal mind to talk to. Alright, let's talk to the brain. Alright, let's go. Is that a stovetop? It looks like a stovetop. You sure we're not sous chefs in some kind of weird zombie cooking show pilot? No, I have I'm all clean. about randomly fiddling the dials, but considering this brain is a limited resource, we better find some instructions first. You got it. Oh, here it is. Quickly scrawl the notes. Sit. Set it to seven. It was just smart enough to write the settings like down. Water. His brain is happy. Shouldn't be too hard to figure out which number goes where. Hold on. Set. Um. Okay. Hold on a minute. Um. Let's look around real quick. Quickly scroll notes. Since you always burn the popcorn, this should should be set to just three. Don't want to smell a burned brain again. Set it to three. Okay, set it to three. Set it to three. This one is... Look for the last time. Set the brain to 41. I think it's 41. And no higher. You don't want to burst them. Okay. Time, temp, range, range, prime. I can quickly scroll note. Just neutral, just neutral, like pure water. The brain is happy. Okay. Seven. Temperature, leave. Okay, so temperature, temperature, um. You always burn the popcorn, there should be set to just three. Okay, three. Is the number three here? No. Time! Three! Okay. And, um. Strong nose. 41. Okay, 41. Temperature. 41. Okay. Um. Let's press the jar, Greg's gold ring, and start. Okay. All right, look at you, oh. Chef Supreme of Brain, Chef Brain ID, Chef Supreme. <laughs> That's all I got. <laughs> I like him. I like this guy already. Find a robo brain. Oh, that's not gonna be good. None of this looks good. Is oh, none of this is good. No, 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 none of this is good. I have the voice of Set, but it's not really a super best weapon. Well, that's a dominator. That's never good. Perimeter movement detected. Possible stealth unit in the AO. Scanning. to fight, but at least we found a Rubble Brain head dome. Okay, now let's head over back to that lab. Okay, here goes nothing. Add Greg's Goldstein's brain. Hey there, buddy. Oh no, oh god. I knew that overtime clause in my contract was a mistake. I don't remember you from the research team. It's been 
Let's see, Ravko is gone, the whole country's been bombed, out of existence, you can just destroy this place after we leave. It's been 30 years, I'm part of a new team, nice to meet you. Intelligence. Uh, let's use... Intelligence. <laughs> okay. Actually, I need your help to find a way to bypass the experimental turrets. Oh, you want me to make tools that will destroy the turrets? Really? Sure. Come on, we'll need to use the fabricators. Follow me. <laughs> you have no idea how many times we had to assemble and tear down the kill zone emplacement until Doctor Diaz was happy. Hey. Oh, not again. Oh, no. Yeah, this is why I don't like this. I'm hitting something. Uh, damn it! <laughs> Woo! Thank goodness you're here. Tools? Can you get to making those tools? Oh yeah, well, I can make it so the power just shuts down completely. Do you know how many times I had to rewire these turrets? I do not know, but I sense you're going to... She made us move them all over the office for <laughs> testing. Every day was different. Oh, not again. This is going to hurt you. Let's grab the tools and go. I don't want to stick around in case this guy cracks. Cracks more. I don't want to see his crack. I better brain is stored somewhere. Might as well go destroy it. Or maybe... Oh, experiment on it. Yeah! Um. As rendezvous back to home base, this place is giving me the creeps. Uh, later, Greg. The game lied to me and told me we would have a normal conversation with him. Let's just get out of here, Radcliffe. Uh, alrighty. We got that done with. Let's talk with the U.S. Army. Captain Fields. Sergeant Radcliffe reports that you procured the tools we need. 
I'm impressed. We made a good team. Interesting choice of words. You've been making a good team for some time now, haven't you? Page, Dr. Hornwright, that hyperactive communist kid, and now us. You sure picked a strange team, but you've shown that you can follow through. I'm convinced you'll actually pull this damn thing off. We'll be packing up and heading over to Foundation. No sense coordinating from two places. Eager to get this done, so let us know when. You got it. Has anyone seen my readers? Oh, hang on, never mind. They're in my pocket. <laughs> All right. Let's reload, repair our gear, and get ready for what is to come. Let's go talk with Paige. You really know that whole over-deliver mantra, don't you? Captain Fields and his soldiers say they're here to stay. We got the crew and the equipment. All that's left is to get to work. You let me know when you're ready, because once we start, it's gonna be real noisy. Are the specialists here yet? Captain Fields and his soldiers say they're here to stay. Any other preparations we can make? No. We're already here. You've built a team, and we're all just waiting on you to lead it. Just let me know when you're ready. Ooh! <laughs> oh, that's a good legendary. Entire armor. Nice. Even if it's a one star, that's still nice. All the guards, too. Siding with Foundation. Alright, guys. This will do it for now. Our last awaited episode will be coming soon. Where we side with the settlers. We will finally take on the vault. Wherever that may be. Somewhere in the mountains. So I'm guessing it's somewhere. Maybe it's here. I think that's where it is. Next anyway. week it'll be my turn on guard duty. I hate those late nights walking. Hopefully we'll be able to get things done. Then we'll, we'll explore the world. And the rest of the channel will just be about, you know, side quests and everything. So let's hope everything works out in our favor. So, see you guys soon enough.